Hello everyone, I'm Cheldon Barlett Rumor and this is it. Welcome back to This Is It TV. Happy Wednesday, Taquan. Happy Wednesday. Yay. I mean, the energy in here is insane. I love this woman. I love her. I love her. This is the first time in the new studio. If you don't know her, shame on you. I just, I mean, I don't even know what to say. But for those of you that don't know her, I need her to introduce herself. Okay. First and last name and so what she's up to. My Tell name me. is Nicole Mahalik. Yes. And I do oh afternoons. Uh, I'm a radio personality. She is. People might know me as Nick the Web Chick. I used to work in Philly radio. So now I do afternoons on 92.5 XTU. It's the country radio station. Yes. I go by Nicole because my parents gave it to me. Right, fair you enough. You know what I mean? So that's You're welcome. what I go with. That's the name of my podcast. <laughs> oh. It's Why Are You Following Me with Nicole. So I figured, you know, my mom actually calls me Nicole Ann. You know? <laughs> Nicole but, Ann. Yeah. Right, Nicole I'll... Ann, oh, you're doodled <laughs> up again today, I see. Oh, where were you? <laughs> Gallivanting. That's literally how my mother talks. Stop. Yeah, she could be a Saturday Night Live character. Yeah. Gallivanting is the truth. Yeah. I think I might use that. She gal gallivanting. That's what does all that she actually, does. What does that mean? So Going it just out? Means that it just means like you're you're always like bebopping. You know Am what I mean? someone who gallivants? Yes, a thousand percent. It means like you're like, oh, running a Walmart with Diane. And right. then all of a sudden you're, you know, dropping off pierogies at Aunt Dorothy's. Right. And then you're going to the- Are these real people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Diane then, and Aunt Dorothy? Oh, yeah. Next and then you're like going to the church with Auntie to like be on the church <laughs> Um, oh gallivants. She gallivants. That's all she does. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I think I need to meet your mom. Yeah. Oh my god, she's hilarious. And that's where you get it from. But she doesn't mean it. Like my dad's actually funny. He's like witty. Okay. My mom is just like has both my parents have big personalities. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Me and my brother are either going to be like wallflowers or like. That's Hi. my children. Luckily, me and my brother are like, Hi! <laughs> right? That's my children, right. too. Right, right. Because Chris, your husband oh, is a great personality. Right. Yeah. So it's either one or the other. Exactly. So my dad's witty, which, and then, but my mom's just very, like, she's that person that's like, oh my God, look how nice this is. It's like, like, ready for fall. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. My earring fell out. No, it's okay. It's, it's, it's it what we do. In. Put it back it's, in. It's just real life. That's Re what we do here. That's what we you do here. I mean? We're trying to give you our best life. Yeah. But this woman has so much, I mean, one, I want to gallivant with you. Yeah. Oh my God. Can that be a thing? Yeah. Or do you gallivant by yourself? No. All right. So I want to gallivant with you. Yeah. Done. On a regular basis. Done. And the funny thing is, we brought up my husband. He says, Sheldon, I'm funny and you're fun. Your parents sound like this. Like one's funny and one's fun. That's a good, yeah. Do you know what I mean? I love that. That's, That's like a yeah. thing. I'm like, I think I'm funny. I'm yes. Funny, by the way, to Guan thinks so too. Okay, we're, just, we're gonna let the earring we're go. We're gonna let the earring go. I might go. take yeah. off mine too. I'll take off one. No, for we you could too. do like one, one at like a time. Mr. Clean. You can't be alone. Did Mr. Clean have? Mr. Clean gets like, rid of dirt and grime and grease and just a little. Remember wait, that? Yeah, and I'm obsessed with the magic eraser. I feel I like I was born in the 70s. Now I know the song. I feel like I the magic eraser eraser doesn't get the love it deserves though. It doesn't get the love right. it deserves because it doesn't have a song. But I appreciate you taking the earring out because it's the inclusion. You know what I mean? Understand. Girl can't be by herself. Right. Take a lesson, ladies. <laughs> Don't let your girl friends be out there like that. Be out there like, <laughs> couldn't leave her hanging either. Okay, so let's talk about this new yes. venture. Because, right, we had met in uh, your transition. Yes. That's exactly the time frame in which you met. Yeah. And you're like, I have this new opportunity. I can't wait to explore it. Yeah. Tell me. I'm obsessed. I am you obsessed. Are. And I think it's such a good lesson, right? Yeah. I never in a million years, if you would have told me uh, this time last year, you're going to be working in country radio. And I was like, okay, sure. But... All this this change happened yeah. in a very short amount of time, and I was presented this opportunity, yeah. and I am obsessed. I, I see. I mean, I just, I love it, and I just think it's such a good lesson yeah. that whether it's God or the universe yes. or whatever yes, higher amen. power you amen, believe amen, in, amen. it you know, sometimes they have to give you a, a, a swift kick and a you-know-what because yeah. they're like, we have a plan, yes. and and it you know it's and it's still I'm doing what I love. What you love. It's just that there's this well. you know what they always say like life's what happens when you're making plans, right? Yes. And yes. so I thought I was going on this one trajectory, and all of a sudden I'm on another, and right. I'm like I never knew that this was a possibility, yeah. and I'm like I love it. Oh my god! And it's a new challenge, yes. and that's the thing for me is that um, I I'm a Leo, yeah. and so like Leos are like. You know, we like yeah. to like nap and just like, we like, you know, we're cats. <laughs> Even though I'm more of a dog person, but like, we like to be it's like fun. cozy. Do yeah, you know I mean? no, right. comfortable. Comfortable. And yeah. so I need that push sometimes. Right, you know fair what I mean? enough. So, and you weren't going to probably take the push. Exactly. Unless somebody Because I was like, happy. I was doing my thing. Even though yeah. in here, you, you know, know, you feel it. And in you here, know. I knew, and I would say it out loud, my talent's being wasted. Yes. I would say it. Yes. But I just was like, where do I go next? Yeah. What am I going to do? And so... 
Unfortunately, my old radio station flipped formats and yeah. I was out of a job and it's very common in radio. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And all of a sudden I got this new opportunity and I'm like, oh my God, it's just learning all these new artists. And obviously yes. I knew like the big artists. You right, know, right, you know right. Blake Shelton, yeah. Kay Chesney, but there's all the, and all the dudes in country radio. <laughs> I mean, uh, I mean, they're tall and hot. Right? Is your yeah. is your job hard? Yeah, it's Nicole like Paul and well, they're all so tall. I'm like, it's like that meme. Like, do I like him or is he just tall? Right? You know, you know. Do you like him? Are they um, they just tall? Yeah, well, both. Does I it matter? Like, does know, it really matter? You know, I haven't got to have that much does time it? with them yet. But you know, no, no. Um, we'll talk about that in the next. Yeah, episode. you know, <laughs> the quality time yeah. she spends. Yeah, earrings yeah. coming. Like off. I haven't been, like, earrings like, haven't spent enough time on the tour bus or anything. You know. Like I love it. So, love but yeah, and it's love it's it. incredible that I'm doing like my own show. You know, it's, yes. it's just me from three to seven. People are on the drive home. I'm learning new music and meeting new listeners. And it's crazy though the amount of listeners though that listen to me on my old radio stations who now transition to the new station uh, before I even came. That it's right. almost like they found this new form. Not new, but right. But you know, country is a universal. I mean, the storytelling of country music. Yeah, but it's also cool right now. Yeah. Like country is like the hottest, it's right. young and hot yes. and poppy. And so it's it's kind of was like so fascinating how this all kind of all happened around the same time and I just feel so blessed oh, you know well everybody's I feel very blessed, blessed to have you and I think Thank but you. but we love it when we see you in your light right like Thank when you, you are doing what you love and I know again you know I think that the lesson here is you know you take the, what is coming before you right yes. whatever it is as opposed to fighting the opportunity yes. and saying no this isn't for me this wasn't part of my plan this isn't my necessary brand you are the brand itself yeah and then you can take that and I think that the, you were about to say or you were leading to or, or I'm gonna infer is that the, the audience that was watching you yeah or listening to you and I'm watching because she's yeah. amazing listening following fanning and liking you has gone with you because of you and I think that that is so awesome yeah well it's there's even people who used to listen to me a couple years ago, left those old stations, yeah. went to XTU, and then when I came on board, they're like, oh my God, I used to listen to you all the time. I'm so excited. Right? So it's just kind of, we both ended up together at the same time. Right. And It's, it's the pivot, though, of life. Yes, yeah. And I, I do that. think that that's such a great lesson is that, you know, I could have been like, oh, this isn't yeah, what I want to do. 100%. And like, I never thought that I was going to do this. But I was like, no, I know that I need a challenge. Yeah. And I know that this is coming to me oh, for this. a reason. I love you know what this. I mean? Yes. And sometimes you're like, you don't know why it's here. Yeah. But then all of a sudden I'm in it. It's I it just it's just been six months. Yeah. And, and I'm just like. Wow, you know, Kane Brown, who's huge in, in yeah. uh, country music, his wife's actually from Westchester. Oh. He was my guest DJ last week, and there he was for like an hour and a half, just me and him. And he's such, and we played his new song on the radio for the first time, and I'm doing my thing, and I was like, I am just, this is why I, like, I was right. just so filled. In your element. So, yes. And I was in like, this is why I do what I do, and I just, just was in that moment was like, wow, you know, and there's yeah. so much passion and I'm a passionate person. And again, never thought this is where I'd be, but the path led me here and I just have embraced it and I'm obsessed. But this is what you deserve. This is what everybody out there deserves, right? Yeah. To yeah. follow what it is that you're you're passionate about doing and living in your truth and in your light all the time. Yeah. I and think it's beautiful. Listening to what your passion is, I think sometimes a lot of people they get caught up in like the money or what they yeah. think they should do. And it's like, yeah. and I ask anytime I meet somebody in the yeah. promo crew, like all the college kids, you yeah, work yeah, at Temple, yeah. I go, Please. what's your dream job? And they're like, well, I mean, <laughs> I go, no, you no, no thinking. Literally, oh what's your gosh. dream job? You have to and come into my class. Can you do that? Absolutely. Oh my God, I don't love, tease. Oh my God. I'm overselling. They're like, you said she was going to come. No, I, I would totally come. Oh my gosh, you have to. Yeah. Oh my God, I can't even. Because they need to hear this. It's like, because they don't know what they're, they I'm don't like, know. I go, no, no limitations. What's your dream job? Oh I'm God, like, I love it. And, and then they're like, oh, okay. I go, stop. What is stop. it? Stop. Stop. But they're like, well, maybe I want to do this. Right. All of these like weird, maybe kind of, sort yes. of, we don't do that here. Nope. She and I, we don't do that. We take off our earrings, we get involved. Mm -hmm. That's what we do. I want everybody to get involved with you. Thank I you. want them to follow Fan and like you at whatever station you are, but we are excited about your new home and we love everything that you're doing. Thank Where you. can people find you? So Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I still have Snapchat even though it's okay. you know, it's I'm not thing. 17. It's fair. Um, it's Nicole is Nick. So N-I-C-O-L-E <laughs> is N-I-K. Nicole is Nick. Follow me, like me. I promise I post fun stuff. Today on my Instagram yeah. story, I talked about how I'm still not over Drake and Rihanna not being together.
All right, well, you're hanging on for dear life to well, that. You know, okay, good Had talk. a baby with a porn star, and look it's, what happened. It's all right. Everybody, everybody's <laughs> living their life. Next on This Is It TV. I can't. I can't. We're going to continue to have a good time. Oh, my God. I love her from all of us here at This Is It TV. I'm Cheldon Barlett Rimmer, and we'll see you soon. Take care. Oh, my God.